the sound of Maghrib is on in Ramadan is usually associated with a fulfilling glass of water and a variety of colorful dishes that people abstain from throughout the day. But as the sun sets, it's only a date, and a glass of water for Abdul Rahim Hajan, 32, who rushes to serve people iftar at Moroccan Taste, a small cozy family-run restaurant that offers homemade Moroccan dishes and sweets in a corner at the La Plage residence in Dubai. Ramadan is a month of worship, forgiveness and tolerance. My favorite part is serving people and feeling that they're happy with the food I'm giving. It makes my day, said Hajin, a Moroccan national who's been residing in the UAE for the past six years. It's like having guests over at home. You do whatever it takes to make them happy and satisfied. Hajin's duty starts when he steps into the restaurant at 2 p.m. to take phone calls and reservations from visitors before starting iftar preparations with six of his colleagues. We divide the work among us to make sure every guest gets their food and drinks on time. The first day is always the hardest until we get the routine going, said Hajin. 7 p.m., visitors, who start to slowly fill up the restaurant, come in to find their table ready with dates, chibakia, Moroccan sesame cookies, harira soup made with tomatoes, lentils, chickpeas and lamb, and orange juice with carrot and cinnamon. Hajin and his colleagues line up a buffet with bruit triangular pastry stuffed with seafood, meat or vegetables, mezmen or ragif, similar to paratha bread served plain or stuffed with minced beef or onions, bigrier, Moroccan pancakes, and stuffed Moroccan bread with vegetables. Soon, freshly cooked dishes of couscous, plum tagine, and peas and artichoke tagine are lined up for people to start their main courses. Hajin properly breaks his own fast around 9.30 p.m. when all the guests leave, before continuing the post-iftar wrap-up until 12 a.m. You get used to it because the reward is from Allah. My satisfaction comes from seeing people's happy faces during the iftar time, he said, pointing out that his favorites for iftar are the harira soup, Moroccan fatir and chicken tagine. healthy and light. The benefit of not having iftar all at once is you slowly adjust your body to food without feeling stuffed, said Hajin. The 10-hour Ramadan shift has no burden over Hajin who says time is not felt in Ramadan. The holy month finishes before you even notice it. You feel like it's a day or two, not a whole month, while the long day of fasting sometimes translates to impatience for some visitors, Hajin said Ramadan puts people to the test. For him, Ramadan is an opportunity to grow on the personal and professional level. Ramadan needs patience. The month teaches you the discipline you need for the entire year. Work-wise, it gives you a lot of experience that helps you develop and improve every year. The giving continues for Hajin when he distributes the remaining food to those in need or to people who have no job to provide them with constant income. We make sure nothing goes to waste and that the food goes to whoever needs it every day, he said. And there's no rest as the restaurant is already starting its eat preparations. We are already receiving orders for Eid delicacies from now. Guests can expect the Moroccan fekas, cookies, gori blan kaab al ghazal to be ready, said Hajin, share